what are the things that the robot can do during the game? Do yeah. we want to make a list of that? Yes. Let's yeah. start with that. Yeah, yeah I think that's I mean, yeah, yeah, like cubes yeah. break out into push, pu push high. them into the exchange. Yeah. Yeah. Um, pick pick them up and put them in the switch baskets. The, 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 I think the they're all called and baskets. The, Switch and the, the switch, well, I think and then the picking them up off the ground. Why are they both? I think that's what the NPCs <laughs> so, are called. Do a uh, first to English yes. column too, if we can. Uh, you can. I think what all of the things that you put uh, cubes into are called baskets. Okay. At least that's what the drawing names were. I think. Basket, so we can just yeah. say. Yeah. So pick up off ground. Just the just want to pick up first off. switch. And I also think you can add a possible action of yeah. helping someone else climb. Also, another is what it's best for our use case after robot in yes. three days too. Yes. Something to keep in mind is that we want to demo a robot at the end of this. Cl our uh, cubes are much more important because climbing is only that last yeah. end game. So, what are the robots that you see being made this year? Uh, a robot that only climbs. Uh, an only climbs. So I think that's a defense not that has, yeah. that, but but it has capabilities for other robots to climb on it. So a climbing centered one, which incorporates features to allow multiple climbs. Yes. I mean, there's obviously so like cube focus. Your, your number ones. one is going to be. Yeah, I mean, that's going to be. There's normal. also a. Um, a switch focused robot where all it does is put stuff on the switch yeah, because yeah. it's the same yeah. point value as the scale and it's a lot easier. Mm -hmm. And they even said yep. so in the video that it's. So I think the next strategy would be a scale yeah. focused robot. Yeah. The scale focused robot could also do the switch because you yep. sort of drop it further. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, you, don't, you don't raise your arm up as high or whatever yeah, the true. height yeah. Yeah. But right. I, However, you're getting it up there, you just yeah. turn it down. You just don't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think you'd I also think have like a power up. If, if you're a power yeah. up for sure, strategy bot. Yeah. Oh that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like that's a right. that's like a straight up rookie bot. Like you can just push those. You don't in even, there that's not even a rookie bot. That's a that's that's a big deal. It, but oh yeah, but it's like super yeah. useful it's for an alliance. But it's, it's a like, significant. But it, it's yeah, not yeah not that would be a second dick. Easy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just have them yeah. do that, and then you're doing scale ones through a switch. No problem strategy. I really don't think climbing would be that useful for us. It would be cool for our video to have a climb, but I mean honestly. So we're never really. Our, we didn't have a climb in 2016, and that was a lot of points. But neither did a lot of teams, and they also didn't. Yeah. And so yeah. the reasoning, we think that climbing is a strategy that teams should go for. Yeah, because they have time to refine it and make it pretty. So we're not yeah. going to focus on it because we don't think we have the resources to dedicate to it. I say I go for the scale I think to so. have some sort of challenge. As yeah. long as the, as long as the robot... The switch robot's really easy. Yeah, yeah. as long yeah. as the yeah. climb yeah. doesn't make our robot... Okay, right. bring this back to 2015 when our robot was 5 feet tall and we couldn't get it down the stairs. We have to keep that in mind when we're designing this robot. If we go for the scale, the robot has to be compact enough to safely get it down the stairs. First of all, we need to drive before we get to the scale. Yeah, that's a priority. Focus on scaling. Gotta get to the scale. Gotta get to the scale. Okay, I see what you're do saying. Do we? I, I do we put? Like, yeah, I, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Do we put ability to get up on the ramp? Drive, pick up, and then priority. Yes. I'm yeah. So. Yeah. 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 It's a guaranteed five high. points if you yeah. just sit there. I mean, it's so. only fifteen degrees, right? So yeah. if as just, long as your drivetrain's reasonable. Yeah. So it just means keeping our drivetrain reasonable. Bro, getting it far enough that you can get so it in. But to refine that journey, we are putting a cube into the exchange. We are manipulating it. We're not just shoving it in front of. Yeah, we're not just a push bot, okay. we've got to actually yeah, manipulate it somehow. You just build in a, a mechanism that can take it in both that way and the enough, other ways. Enough compliance yeah. in your mechanism. Yeah, yeah. Like, so. you have to have Oh, hey, look at that, we're in the mechanism section. Um, yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, yeah. The um, question about this is that if oh, you're grabbing on this, you if you're grabbing it like that support. side, yeah, that's gonna you're going to punch right through, you break you're it, gonna punch you right through that with, you if you're grabbing with any force. Yeah. No, that's, that's what I'm saying. Is it, it's difficult oh, to manipulate person. if okay. it's not in the correct orientation. Could, right? so this would be the narrowest intake, though. Is the it thing. Would. So you don't yeah. need a lot more than this. We have a brand new Andy Mark frame that we can use if people want, and it can be used in either the long or wide configurations. And so it can have six six wheels or four wheels, and it can either take six inches or four inches. But um, I've never built a tall robot that had a drop center because it'll tip. And this robot yeah, at full um, extension is going to be upwards of seven yeah, feet tall. Well, yeah, we have four so, inch omnis. So if we do it at four inch, we can do a knot drop with but omnis. Omnis slide a lot. On I mean, you, just, you only have to do, you only have to do one set of omnis of your six. Oh, do a pair of omnis at one end. Yeah, yeah. Because that'll prevent us from rocking. That I mean, 
you know, so a quarter inch of rock at eight feet extension is not negligible. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, but I don't know. It depends on it depends on your it frame. Like configuration. If you're if you're wide, then yes, it's a problem. But if you're in the long configuration, I'm not as worried. Yeah. Um. So it just depends on how you have the frame set up. I think the main question when it's like long versus wide frame is where are we putting our box that, when we well, yeah, take it. Should we actually should we start go doing farther and then loop back? Yeah, yeah, yeah I think so. Wide. The sizing of drivetrain is based on the rest of the mechanism. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. So we'll come back to this. Client. So that how can you pick up a cube? There's two the, obvious options. Well, there's the claw and rollers. Claw and the or rollers. rollers. <laughs> so we definitely want to be able to pick it up in any orientation. Do we want to be able to reorient no. it? Why? It doesn't matter. No. Why? Yeah, Why? Well, like you can fit. Uh, you can what? fit it in any orientation. I think you, you can fit, you can fit more on if you flip them up this way. Yeah. So there's the catapult method, or however you shoot it, be it with wheels or however you really want to do it. And then there's also the arm, the lifting thing, or lift and drop, lift and drop yeah. or lift and like stoosh out. The similarities between being a robot that focuses on the vault and switches, like that's basically the same robot, right? Yeah. Yep. And that's a hugely valuable strategic role this year. Okay, so that's not very far to do. So quite an you arm can't be quite launching. at the back of the field. You can't be quite pressed. All you need is a bumper in it, so you can actually hit the diagonal. But well, that, that you're not going to be sitting unless your catapult set up at unless your catapult setting diagonal. You should probably plan to be centered on the wall. I would think. How large do we have to make the robot for it to get a lift arm that'll actually get up that high? Yeah, because right. that was one of our discussions. Is we need so, to keep it in something we can actually transport. Yeah. Yeah. Pneumatic, you just variable the timing on your valves, and you can yeah. get infinite shot profiles. Okay. So, so I guess the question is: is the quickness of the catapult and ease of design is that worth and the size. inaccuracy? Also, so the other yeah, yeah, size 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 the demos. is that worth the potential? Yeah, and that's and, fair. Uh, <laughs> at least it's brought up a really good one. Do we want to throw cubes at demos? Because balls kids? were fine because they're dodgeballs and they're soft and tuggly. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah, the balls last year were a little eh, even, but yeah. those, that, that can hurt somebody. Yeah. <laughs> the catapult isn't a plus or a minus for it because if we're doing a catapult, we have to have something that's short enough that you can just knock it into a switch anyways, right? So the, that's just, a, as far as the demo goes, that just means taking off the long shot. What do we need to do in order to make a decision on these? Do we need the designs? I'd like to see the geometry for the catapult worked out before we do yeah. it. And I want to see the geometry for the lift arm too. The, the, the point is, how, like, what, do, what, do, what, does, what do the dimensions require to make these happen look like? What is the power requirement for us to launch something up in the air that's like that? I'll what are the dimensions of a, yeah, yeah, a lift that. arm that, yeah. require, that we need to get up to our whatever our... I don't know what the edge of it is at. Yeah. I want to see sketches for all of those. 